So there's a new Google Classroom feature coming uh, alongside uh, class visits, which we demoed previously. Uh, just a quick recap there, class visits lets you assign out the ability for senior leaders or support staff uh, or directors of a department to visit a class so they can uh, temporarily have access to another teacher's class. So useful if you're covering a lesson for a supply teacher or wanted to check student work. Uh, so that's class visits. But a new feature coming alongside class visits is classroom analytics. So this is going to be a really interesting feature for senior leaders, department directors who want to get insights into how Google Classroom is being used on your Google domain, but also uh, getting insights into and how different teachers are using their classes, how many students are uh, submitting their assignments on time, uh, what's their grade level like. So let's just have a quick look at it now. So when you first launch it, you come to this interface where you can uh, control I mean, how much data we're looking at here. So I've just got 30 days selected. We can increase it to 90 days. I'm also looking at a particular OU, so I can filter it by organization unit as well. I can see how many classes uh, I have access to, to, to check here. So I've got 10 students who are on 217 classes, so quite a high number of classes for these students. I can see what their assignment completion rate looks like. I can see their average grade. And I can see the number of active students as well. And I can also filter that if we scroll down here by classes. So I can select one of these classes and see more details about that. I can see what's happening by student as well. So I can see how different students are performing. So for instance, I could click on uh, Ron Reasley and see what he's been up to in classroom lately. So I can see how many assignments he's been completing, what the average grade is, uh, which classes they belong to. And I can also filter this by organizational unit, which I've already done here. So I've just got our, our demo users selected here, uh, but I could be a bit more uh, bespoke and just select a particular year group if I wanted to. So let's just select the middle school. And that updates these results then to just show those classes belonging to those students in the middle school. Uh, you can also helpfully uh, export these results. So you can save these as a PDF to share with other people. And um, yeah, I think this is going to be a, quite an interesting new feature. Before this, the only way of getting this type of information across your entire domain would be to set up something like BigQuery export, uh, which we covered before in previous meetings, and use the classroom analytics template. Uh, but this will take out all those steps and it makes it much easier you know, for you to give out visibility for directors or senior leaders to see this information. And it can just be assigned using an admin role in the admin console. So uh, yeah, really easy to set up. I'm not sure when it's being launched exactly. Uh, this is a, a really early preview. So you're probably some of the first people in the world to, to see this. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll keep up to date. And when we do know it's uh, available for, for beta or being launched, we'll let you know.